Hello everyone, my name is Hans Code and today I'm going to demonstrate to you how you can get the latest version of Godot on Linux Mint or Ubuntu based distros. Now the first thing we need to do, we need to make sure we have git installed and that can be done by writing sudo apt-get install git. Let's press enter to install it. And now when that is installed make sure it works by typing in git and it does because now we have commands from git. So let's begin by going onto Godot's official website, which is godotengine.org. We're going into community here. Under here we should be able to find the GitHub, and this is where the engine can be found. So let's go into Godot here, and let us select clone or download. Just copy this link, just press this button here, we just select everything and copy. Let's go back into the terminal here, and now you have to navigate to where you want to put the Godot source code. So I am going into a folder named git, so I'm just going to write cd git. Inside there I'm going to type git clone and then paste in the URL for the repository and press enter. Now a new folder named Godot will be created and inside there is where you'll find all the source files for Godot engine. But what we want to do, we want to compile those source files so we can get the absolute latest version of Godot available. Now when that is done, I'm going to navigate inside the Godot folder, and from here we are going to compile it. But before we can compile anything, we need to make sure we have all the dependencies. So let us go back to Godot's official website, select docs, let's go down to compiling here on the left side, and under here you can find compiling for several operating systems. Now since we are going to use a Ubuntu based distro, or rather Linux Mint, I'm going to select x11. Now scroll down and you can find the distro specific one-liners. So you can just copy this and you can paste this inside the terminal. So if you have other distros such as Fedora, FreeBSD or so on, you can just copy these and use the one that matches your operating system. And let's paste in the one-liner code. Now I have already done this ahead of time so it's probably gonna just tell me that nothing has been installed here and it haven't since I already have it. But for you just make sure to press Y to accept the installation and when it's done we are ready to continue! So all you have to do now in order to compile the source code is to enter in scans platform equal x11. And what this does is it will compile this source code inside Godot here for our platform Linux. So I'm gonna press enter now and it will take its sweet time to compile. And this may take 10 minutes, it may take 30 minutes or who knows, longer depending on your computer's spec. Now I'm gonna skip ahead so you don't have to watch all of this. Finally, it is done! It took about 10 minutes for me to compile the entire thing. So don't worry if it takes a while, just do something else while it compiles. So when it's finished now, what I'm now going to do, I'm going to get the executable version of our file. Here I have Godot folder, which we cloned from Git. Now what happened after compiling is, inside bin here, we now have Godot x11 tool 64. And this is the file we want to run this. I'm just gonna drag this to the desktop so I have it easily available. And then I can just double click this, because this is a, this is the entire engine inside this one file. So now we have the latest version available of Godot. If this video was helpful to you, please hit the like button. If you haven't already, subscribe to see more videos. And I hope to see you in a future video. Bye bye.